people who seem to think that they have a legitimate right to Sabah. Actually, there is no such thing. Uh, I believe that we have always honoured our commitments. Even today, the federal government is paying $10,000 ringgit to the Kedah government for the lease on Penang and province policy. Not that it is uh, something that we must do, because we give the Kedah government much more money, but this is just to show, show that when we enter into any agreement, we honour the agreement. Now Sabah was leased, and that lease was inherited by us, and of course we continue to pay, but that does not give anybody the right to the land that has been leased. Uh, and I, uh, part of the agreement, of course, involves in uh, these people who have leased the land, living, uh, not interfering with the land, as much as uh, Kedah does not interfere uh, with some with Neng and Province Wellesley. I think we should, but of course we don't have an army to send into Penang and reoccupy Penang, claim it for Kedah. It is uh, something that you don't do. All operations cost money. You, if you are completely bankrupt, I don't think you can mount an invasion. Uh, so where does the money come from? Uh, I don't think the Sultan, uh, the Alex Sultan of Sulu is a rich man. Uh, according to the Philippines uh, government, he is a very poor man. But where does the money come from? Uh, somebody, I think, uh, thinks that uh, an invasion of that kind can be of some benefit to them. So that is a question that I personally would ask. And I think lots of people, I think the police would want to know where the money is coming from. Uh, it's unfortunate that these people should have some fantastic idea. And this has uh, resulted in the death of our security personnel and of course death on their part, on their, of their people who invaded this country. I think you should send a message also to Malaysians that uh, we will defend Malaysians whatever uh, may be the situation. So I would like to say that this is a recognition of, of the sacrifices made by police personnel and of course army personnel as well for their the sacrifice that they have made in defense of the, uh, their country.